morning guys, so I'm just literally crouched on the floor um, because I'm just about to do my hair. I'm going to meet Ellie for a walk, which I'm so excited about. Um, hers is like, we live pretty close. You guys will know her from Instagram, obviously. She's one of my best friends, Ellie Rose Tyrrell. Um, yeah, we're gonna go for a meet her for a walk on her lunch break. And yeah, I'm just getting ready currently. I'm using um, Alice's Dyson straighteners. So I thought I'd just do a little quick, um, what's it called? Uh, oh my God, am I right? Time lapse of me using them so you can see like how I use them. I use these not to straighten, but to like blow dry effects. But guys, I'm telling you, I am really considering getting the air wrap. I know it's so expensive, but I've like, I'm thinking I'm just gonna treat myself with some of the money that I've earned recently or from Instagram. Um, obviously, yeah, I know they're so expensive, but I just know that I will use them like forever. Um, so yeah, I'm currently thinking about that one. I'll let you know when I decide. But if any of you guys have got the Dyson Air Wrap, please comment down below and tell me if it's worth getting because I'm very tempted. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna do my hair. Oh, it's not on. I basically wait for it to heat up and then I just take it like this and roll it down. And sometimes it gives more of like, if you can see what the look that gives, like it's just kind of like a blow dry look, which I love. So I just do that all around my hair and then I'll be back with you to show you what it looks like afterwards. So it's going to be quite hard to show you because I'm wearing black but basically it gives this like blow dry effect when I do that kind of movement all my, around my hair and then I basically just add some dry shampoo into it which I'll do in a second and some hairspray just so it like bulks out a little bit more at the top um, and then yeah it tends to like drop out but I just love the blow dry effect I think it's so nice also my outfit today I've got on this little cropped zip kind of sports top from misguided and then these are from Zaful as well which I love these are like ribbed ribbed leggings and they're so cute um, I love this outfit and I'm gonna wear a big brown um, coat from Boohoo as well so yes I am gonna finish getting ready and then I'll speak to you in a bit because I need the steps um, and I need the exercise so yeah and it's supposed to be it's literally so sunny today like it's the one day in so long London has been sunny like I'm shook when I woke up this morning I saw the sun coming through my doors so I was like wow it's actually sunny I might also pick up a um, coffee on the way but yeah I'll see how I feel <laughs> So, oh my god, the lighting's so nice. Um, I just, I finished just seeing Ellie. I meant to like vlog with Ellie, but she only had a little bit of time on her lunch break and we were just chatting, catching up and getting a bit of Instagram content as well. So yeah, I literally forgot to get the camera out, which is really annoying, but yeah, it was so lovely, of course. Probably gonna see her in a few days as well. Um, so I'm just walking back now. I had like a small rant on my Instagram earlier, basically because you, you'll probably, if you follow me on Instagram, you will have already seen that. But I am just so, I'm going to explain to you guys in case you don't follow me. I am just so sick and tired of pervy, weird, old men, like, just staring for no reason. Like, I'm a 23-year-old girl, why are you staring at me? Like, it's just so strange at this point. Um, and, like, last week I was with my friend Grace on a walk. 
and they were, these like group of men were just like looking at us for so long shouting stuff they didn't move like they just stood in like a little circle just staring and so i turned around and i was like what do you want are you okay like do you need something and then they like kind of backed up a bit got a bit squirmy because we called them out but yeah it honestly just infuriates me like i just can't be dealing with these men anymore and then when i was walking to meet ellie earlier um these men were just like staring and i literally pulled a face at them directly i was like what do you want and they still continue to stare so yeah i'm just so sick of it basically what i wanted to point out is because i want other girls to feel like they can say something and they can back themselves up and not just let people stare at them and like be weird and pervy oh my god this house is so nice um but yeah anyway that's my little rant over i'm gonna walk home and i'll speak to you in a little bit <laughs> But look at the light in here today it's so lovely it's so sunny and i've just been eating this really yummy um pasta which i showed you in my last vlog actually this is the last portion of my hello fresh bacon and mushroom rigatoni and it's literally so yummy with feta so i'm just having this as like a late lunch it, it, it is quarter three um so i'm gonna eat this i'm gonna do a bit of social stuff i need to make a reel and go through some pictures and some content that i've got today also yeah the real footage is here so i need to go through that and then i think i might go to sainsbury's and pick up a few bits i've also just had a big box to delivered as well which i'll show you i've got no idea what it is um yeah i'm gonna go to sainsbury's i think because i want to make some homemade flapjack and i really want some chocolate um like chocolate drops chocolate um what do you call them top chips to put in my um flapjacks so i think that's what i'm gonna do when I've had my lunch and done a few bits in the flat. Um, this bacon pasta is so yummy. I love it, I'm definitely gonna order this one again if it comes up on future HelloFresh menus because it's just so yummy, I love it. Guys, I've received this parcel and I have literally no idea what's in it and it's really big as well. So this package is from Rehab London and they actually reached out to me ages ago but I kind of forgot, thought they forgot to send me what they said they were going to send me. And I think, oh my god, it's literally full of smoothies. Oh my gosh. That is unreal. The packaging is so nice as well. So I think these are like semi-frozen. Um, I guess I can read more about it here. A natural skincare supplements. I would not use these like as an actual detox. I just use them as like an extra healthy bit of, um, like an extra healthy dose of uh, your five a day. But amazing. Oh my God, there's so many. So I'm sure me and Alice will enjoy those. So thank you to Rehab London. This is... Um, the brand if you want to order them online obviously they do um, post them which is amazing and yeah I think the, the idea is that it's a juice cleanse but you could just get these as well to be healthy or like a healthy snack I don't know what the um, flavours are does it have the flavours? just while we were on the topic of PR I thought I'd show you this gorgeous sweater this lovely girl made, um, sent me so her store is called Limpet Store I will put it on screen for you or down below just so you can get the exact store but it's like a little Instagram shop and she makes the most amazing beautiful embroidered sweaters with like the cutest little designs on and I went for this one because I just love a snack like I just love a snack so much and I thought this was like, ideal for me and it's really big and oversized which I love um 
and it's white and I love how the pink there's like pink um, and colours embroidering it's so so beautiful so yeah she sent me this kindly so I wanted to give this a shout out because it's a lovely little brand and I love supporting smaller businesses so yeah definitely go and check out um, her store and I think these would make like the cutest gift for like a best friend or like a family member because they have loads of different little slogans and like different little pictures and stuff they're so 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 cute um, and I love the branding of her store as well so yeah thank you so much to the lovely girl that sent me this it's just the cutest thing ever okay so from Sainsbury's I got obviously a bottle of Frixino I mean Alice this is our favourite so Frixino Rosé um, Prosecco is just so yummy and um, they have an offer in Tesco at the moment which is stunning didn't go to the big Sainsbury's I just went to the Tesco close to me because I couldn't be bothered to be honest I got us some popcorn and also some of my faves, um, fizzy strawberry laces because I have basically have these really cute little popcorn bags, let me show you, um, that I got from Cherries, um, but I have these little popcorn bags, so um, for me and Alice when we're filming tonight, I think we can, that will look really cute as like a little prop and obviously to eat as well, um, so that's why I got those, and then also I got some raspberries because I kind of fancy pancakes in the morning and I don't have any toppings, so I got some raspberries and then lastly I got some chocolate chunks, the milk ones to put in my flapjack. So I'm gonna show you now how I make my homemade flapjack recipe because it's yummy and it's pretty healthy as well without the chocolate. Like it's just really, really healthy actually. So I'm gonna do that now. So you don't in any way need all these ingredients at all. It's just cause I have a lot in my cupboards. Like I have so many um, like super foods that's all packed, that's packed to the back, like in here and all of these. So I just happen to have loads. Basically what you do, I don't measure anything out guys, I just whack it all um, in a pan all together and warm it up and add loads of butter, well not loads, but quite a bit of butter just to make it stick together and then I also add this Agave, Argave syrup, which is like a little bit healthier the normal like sugar sweeteners so I also add this and um, this is all the same brand by the way they sent me this box ages ago of stuff and their stuff is lovely I especially love their cacao powder this is like what makes things taste like really chocolate chocolatey um which I love so I'm just gonna bung all these together in a pan heat it up and then I'm gonna put it in the oven for 10 minutes and we're done <laughs> Basically what I do is I just make like a little tin foil base because I've not got a baking tray, I put it on the tray and put it in the oven. So I just heated all the ingredients together with honey and butter and literally just eyeballed it and then I added some extra chocolate chips. And I'm probably going to add some more on the top as well. Um, what would also be nice with this um, is a drizzle of peanut butter on the top. Like I do have peanut butter but I don't know if it's a bit much with all the chocolate so I'm just going to try it like this for now. Um, but I'm just going to wrap up the sides of the tin foil. Sorry the dishwasher, the washing machine is so noisy. It always sounds like it's literally going to take off. So I'm just going to wrap up the sides. Like this. So I've just got the last bits of a fizzy vitamin C. I love these so much. Me and my mum always drink these. So you know they like healthy Lucasades. Uh, I'm just going to pop on the last episode of The Drowning. Everyone's talking about it. Oh my god. Mute. Also, Married at First Sight is... Oh my god, mute. Why is it not muting? What the hell? Are you okay? Um... Married at first sight is unreal. But I'm just gonna pop on The Drowning. It's honestly so good. It's on channel five, guys. And am I okay? Right there. Oh my god, what am I doing? I think I do need to put you guys on charge for a little bit longer. Um just so I mean Alice have got um enough battery to film tonight. But you guys asked some really good questions. We're basically doing it all about the realities of moving to London and Alice is an accountant, or she's like <laughs> She's training to be an accountant so um compared to me we have such different jobs like i do marketing and hospitality and she does accountancy so you guys have asked her some questions as well which is really fun and i'm really happy about um oh god it's so noisy out there um so yeah it's gonna be fun but what time is it it's only like half four so yeah i'm just gonna wait for her to finish work <laughs>
So, um, I've just been enjoying my gin. I'm actually going to go top it up in a second. Alice is on a work, no, she's talking to her work friends, I think, over Zoom. So, I'm sure she'll be joining in a little bit. Um, I was literally, I literally promised myself that I wouldn't get a takeaway tonight because I do have food in. But... I've got an order to take away. Basically, Deliveroo do that two weeks of free trial where you get free delivery and you can just cancel it, obviously, as soon as you have to pay for it. <laughs> probably shouldn't be encouraging that, but anyway. So I've done that, so I get free delivery for two weeks of delivery, which means I'm probably going to rinse it. And um, not in like a, like a way that makes London sound better than other places, but delivery in London is honestly next level. Like, it's just so good. It's so hard to resist, but... Tonight I just went up for like a classic Pizza Hut because they had a deal on where it's £12.99 for a feast for one and that is a medium pizza and a side and a dip which I think is a pretty good deal so yeah it's cost me nothing because it's free delivery. So I've got that on the way and yeah I feel a bit guilty but I'm like don't feel guilty because it's literally locked down. There's nothing else to like buy or spend money on and I'm allowed a treat so even though my face is like honestly getting a little bit moonier by the day like getting rounder but anyway it's fine guys we're allowed to, i just need to i'm allowed to treat we're allowed to treat ourselves in lockdown even though i treat myself like every day at the minute but anyway it's fine um so i'm just gonna pour the rest of my gin actually it's lovely i've got this is a mixture of gordon's normal and gordon's pink and um, just because i had some normal still left left in the can but i'm just gonna pour the rest of my pink gin out of the can. I really love um, pink gin, it's so good. And yeah, wait for Alice to come and join me and then probably watch Married at First Sight and then, um, and then yeah, we're gonna film, hopefully film this video for you guys at some point tonight as well. So I have ordered. Um, I got obviously garlic and herb tips because this is a packaging. I was about to say this packaging is giving me Christmas vibes. It's Christmas packaging. What the hell? I ordered wedges, obviously, and I got a Hawaiian pizza because life. I love. Oh my god, that looks so good. Love Hawaiian pizzas. And Alice's delivery's literally just come, so she's got to get hers, and she's got wing stop, which is also delicious. <laughs> This is fries. Oh my god, that actually looks so good. I also like the packaging. Mmm, <laughs> <laughs> yummy. Good morning, guys. So I realised that I didn't vlog anymore last night. I just, what time is it? It's half ten. Woke up at eight because the buzzer went off for this parcel. This is the cutest Galantine's parcel ever from Funkin' Cocktails, but I'm actually gonna show you in the next vlog. Sorry about that, a bit close to Valentine's. It's literally so cute, like that is how you do PR. I'm obsessed. Um, and I've been watching Sarah Ashcroft's vlog in bed. I'm just gonna make um, a few notes of what I wanna do this weekend. And I've been having also tried one of these Rehab London drinks and it was so good so yummy like the nicest juice and because they give them new fruit frozen i left this over in the fridge overnight it was kind of like slushy vibes when i drank it and it was so yummy so i had that and a coffee and i'm just gonna chill but i'm gonna end the vlog here because i'm not doing anything today and i just want to have a day off social media and like just chill out we're gonna watch love island all day i think like old love island and have some food and stuff so yeah i really hope you enjoyed this vlog apologies for how bad i look right now and um, my skin is having a moment today it's got a lot better overall but 
for some reason on camera my skin shows up way more red and raw like in real life these are actually it's like it's not the scars are not that red which is strange that it shows up more on camera but um anyway at least I, these aren't like actual spots it's just scarring i've just got a couple spots here and one here but my skin is definitely getting better overall i'm just gonna try and keep on working on it um but anyway yeah thank you so much for watching and i will see you very soon in my next vlog Mwah.